Walk up this morning, think I'm about to go some of the day. Best friend got caught up when I stayed in Douglasville. Hey everyone, what's going on with y'all today? I got Atlanta Boy, the merch. So, this is what we rocking this year. We are Atlanta boys, we are Atlanta girls, we are Atlanta people. We represent where we from, and I'm from Atlanta. So, y'all should be getting some merch with the Atlanta boy. Or y'all can call me Tario. If y'all do get the merch, y'all can text me on Tario underscore 3000, and I will shout you out and post you. This is all the merch right here. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at the art print. Okay, look at the gal. Well, we don't really mess with galaxies here. We iPhone gang, but but it's okay if you do have a Galaxy or a Samsung. We do not discriminate. You know. That being said, go ahead and get yours at Redbubble.com. Peace. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another. <laughs> <laughs> What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video today. So today we got Childish Gambino break down his lyrics. Let's get into it. It came out November the 9th, no, in 2011. I remember that year. I remember that year. Crazy times. So your songs are definitely full of a lot of metaphors and wit. How much does your acting and comedy fuel your music? Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, I mean, I, I look at them all as the same thing. People always ask, like, oh, how do you separate? They're all the same to me. Like, I, I mean, like, as long as I'm being, like, honest and true to myself, like, I feel like they're all the same. I'm never, like, when I sat down and wrote the album, I was looking at, like, some of those punchlines became punchlines in my stand-up. Like, it's it's just fantastic, like because I definitely felt that. Mm -hmm. Well, there's a few um, interesting lyrics that I, I kind of want you to explain to me okay, here. Okay, cool. All right, so, Butcher and I Know It, Man, Kill Beef, Go Ham. Please mm -hmm. explain. Okay, uh, Butcher and I Know It, Man, like, that's, you know, Kill Beef, Go Ham is something in the rap community mm -hmm. used to mean, like, oh, I go hard on this beat. Like, I, I, I kill beef, I, you know, I get rid of the beef between rappers because I'm that good, and I go ham, which is, you know, going hard as a mm -hmm. M. Uh, and oh, wow. Butcher okay. does both of those things. They kill beef and they, they make ham. So, yeah, it's, a, it's a metaphor. <laughs> that's a fantastic. Metaphor. Learn something new every day. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, I, d I don't talk soft. That's the other guy. Who's the other guy? I was just talking about other dudes in general, other yeah. rappers. Like, uh -huh. I feel like, I don't know, I was missing... I mean, like, I know I'm silly, but I can be aggressive. And I felt like, you know, I kind of felt like the aggressiveness that I exude is a little different. I feel like there's a lot of dudes who who say like, just like, oh, like, who hear one song of mine and like, oh, it's soft. I'm like, no, that's, you, like, listen to my other stuff. Yeah, listen like, to the that's whole most album. Of the time. Cause I get in trouble. Well, it's judge. weird, like, I get this thing, I'm just like, people are like, oh, you're too soft for this. And then other times I'm like, oh, you're too now, hard. Now, now, speaking of a soft rapper, mm. right? So your album drops the same day as Drake's Take yes. Care. How do you, yes. how do you feel about that? I feel pretty good. I mean, like, it's good for hip hop, honestly. Uh -huh. mm. I mean, like, I don't know why people always want to like spark beef between rappers. I, there's a whole Tumblr dedicated to me versus Drake, which I just think is really funny. But like, I don't even think we're in. I'm like Drake is Drake. Like, people hardly know who I am. You know? Well, I'm just saying I'm on your side. You're on That's my all side. I'm gonna say. Oh really? That's all I'm gonna say. Why do you have Drake beef with Drake? What's going on? What's going well, on? Well, we can discuss this later. Okay. You know what all I'm right. saying? We won't do it in front of the cameras. <laughs> okay. I mess with that. I mess with that. I, I like the small, these small little breakdowns because you get to see where an artist at, well, Childish Gambino at at certain like times in life. I remember I was still in, I was in fifth grade. I was in fifth grade. No, I was in sixth grade. Damn, I was in sixth grade. Time fly by, bro. I swear, man. But time, let me know what y'all think. What, what grade was y'all in <laughs> in November 9th, 2011? Let me know. What was you doing at that day? Like, was you in school? Was you out of school? Was you working? Let me know in the comments below. Peace. I'm, I, this went whole left. My, <laughs> my bad, everyone, bro. I just, man, I be like. Are you the poet? 